Yes, you read the title correctly. I've gotten scammed. And what did it cost me? Well, it didn't cost me everything, but it did cost me my job. So you're probably wondering how did I get scammed? So, basically, I was up at the register. I was, I was just minding my own business, just doing nothing. And all of a sudden, I get a phone call. Here I am thinking it was a regular customer about to ask me a thousand different questions and ask me obvious and stupid questions. But, instead of that, which I would have rather had, I had this random guy... Claiming to be HR from for World Farms, he was saying that there that we were getting a couple of complaints that what was it? What was it? What was it? Home Depot and the Netspin gift cards were were not activating. So what this guy did, he had me go pick out both of those cards, scan them. Put whatever put whatever amount he asked me to put in the computer and then hit exact exact change and tell him the code over the phone. And after that he's like he told me to like check out the receipt, write 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 the ID number and the verification code. And I'm, and I'm thinking everything everything sounds legit, but what I, what I found funny while I was doing that he, I forgot to I forgot to tell y'all that he said that he, he he had spoken to one of the managers. I, I don't know why I didn't ask him what manager did did he spoken to because that that probably that most likely would have caught him off guard. But my mind wasn't working that night for some odd reason, of course. So. He had me do that, do inventory, meaning he forced, literally forced me to count all the cards they had over at the gift card section. And, and yeah, and after I got all that done, I went home. I, I got off at 11.30. I shouldn't have gotten off, off at 10, but this man had me stay well over an hour just to do all of that get scammed I mean I still got extra money but <sighs> anyway so I'm so I'm thinking to myself did, did I just get scammed right now because I, I honestly found it fishy and then of course I actually got scammed you want to know how I got scammed I went in the next day the district manager was there and the store manager was there. Well, she was already working that morning, but they were both there. They had me go outside and ask, and ask me what happened that night because I was really short in my drawer. And I, t and I told them about the situation. And that's, and that's when the district manager said that I got scammed. And that's when, and, and that's when the... Story manager jumped in saying that, well, according to the World Farm Scott guideline, you're really not supposed to tell the pe people over the phone the price of anything at all. And then not only that, once you get scammed, you're automatically terminated, which I got as soon as I got in, I immediately got terminated. They they could have they could have called me at least, but no, they made me waste. How long was it? Thirty minutes of me being clocked in just to tell me that I got skinned and I'm fired from the job. I'm not stressing over it, but I am mad that I have no job. I mean, I'm glad that. I'm not working there anymore, but I'm at the same time because now I'm jobless and it's clearly the wrong time to be jobless 
especially when there's a pa pandemic still going on. Whenever that's over, I'm hoping that everything is back to normal, but who knows? But at the same time, it, it's still it, it's still the wrong time to be jobless. Because Thanksgiving and also Christmas. And it's also hard to find a job as well because what I just said earlier. But I'm not stressing over it. Uh, right now I'm just I'm just chilling and being me. And not only that, I've been meditating and doing what what I want to do, like meditate, draw, start, and also start doing more videos like I've been trying to do over the past months now. And I could have because of my job, but. Since I'm jobless, I can do whatever I want for the for the time being. So, get ready, folks, because I'm going to start uploading way more than before. Because I will usually like upload it like once a like one time in a month, <laughs> and then come back two months later. But I'm gonna try my best to start uploading every day which starts now.